Hey up guys, before I be getting into the rundown of this really sick double barrel SSG24, I just want to do a quick announcement because we're changing the channel structures here at Norwich. I wanted the gameplays and the vlogs, which are, you know, usually the story about the gameplays, it should all be on the same channel. So we'll be taking the vlogs back onto this main channel. The Norwich vlog channel is now changing into Norwich Tactical. I'm gonna link it down below. And there you're gonna find DIY tutorials for gear, sniper tactics, then why did I set up my gear the way it is and all that kind of stuff. So if you want to check that out, again, link in the description, subscribe to this channel to stay updated. But now let's get right into the double barrel SSG24 round now. That's up guys, today we present to you the double barrel SSG24, which means Magnus built this incredible stock here made out of wood, handmade, couple hundred hours probably invested to create this double barrel sniper, which means, you know, you pull one side, you pull the other side, and then you basically have a two-shot sniper rifle. It shoots with three tools each and five has been playing with it. Much more about that later. First of all, how do you build this? I built it together with my father, yeah. who is a carpenter and therefore has uh, experience with it. It was actually, as you said, a lot of work. I could imagine that. Yeah, it, it looks like a lot of work. It took uh, Probably a hundred hours like this, something. Yeah. So basically we made it out of plywood. The basic material was one layer and then yeah. we just um, build it up from there. So one layer, the second layer and the third, the third layer. Yeah, and it took two, yeah, you can see it. You yeah. can see it. Yeah. So obviously you can't use the same board handle. So one runs the left hand conversion kit, one is the normal board handle. And then in order to pull the trigger, you have to go through both trigger guards and pull both at the same time. Uh, racking is obviously I'm probably yeah. tell you about this. Yeah, it's super exhausting. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, we try to connect both, yeah, but it's impossible to pull two M150s. Yeah, so just, you you can make it, but like we put the stuff here at the handle behind the end cap, so you're limited with your arm. Like, yeah, you go uh, and then. You, you can't go further back. Yeah, exactly. Because, because House Gamer built something s oh, yeah. not similar actually, just taped two of those ASG and 40s together, like Spotline ones. And the spring is quite weak, so you know, it just connected it with a string, I think. Yeah, and he yeah, pulled it like this and pushed it back in. And it didn't even lock it with a handle, I think. It was just push, yeah. pull, and then you put the trigger. But, you know, obviously with the SG being much stronger than that, it's, it's impossible to do. So just, you know, rack once, rack a second time. Ah. And then you are ready to shoot. But actually it's not too bad. Once you get yeah. used to it, it's like... So how do the people react when they get hit by two times three shoots? <laughs> how does that go? They're like, whoa, what's going on? Often I didn't hit with both BBs. Like, yeah. People stand behind cover and you try to aim for them and only one BB hits them. Like there's only a hand coming out or they just yeah. peek with their head. So only one BB get there. I think I got two or three shots where they actually two BBs hit the guys and they're like, <laughs> oh, that hurt. <laughs> so yeah, I mean you can see it in the video. Yeah, yeah. I also liked how you put the the length to pull adjustment. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, that's it makes it look kind of tactic, way. like it's on a wooden stock, like a tactical yeah. wooden stock. So that's cool. Yeah, it was proper um, made. Yeah, it is proper made. Then you 3D printed those mounts, right? Yeah. So you can have the, the scope in the middle. Yeah. I'm surprised that you did that. Like I would have just if you just leave it on one. You know, then at least you have the one precision shot and the other one just, you know, if it hits yeah, a lot, who the hell is yeah. yeah. But also for the scope cam, it's better, so we mount the scope cam on top, so you have it in the middle. Oh yeah, true, so the, the most PVs yeah. come out simultaneously. Yeah. yeah, that's cool. Though. So yeah, uh, if you want to check out the gameplay of Fabi struggling with this beast of, <laughs> I don't know, like 6 kilograms or something, and him just struggling with the both portals, I'm uh, gonna link it down in the description. I want to check out Magnus channel. Did you make a video about how you created it? Uh, no, not really. Not really. It's all on Fabi's channel. You can check it out there. It's hilarious to see how you're struggling with the board force, then the people just uh, kind of dying from getting shot by this thing. It's fun to watch. So if you guys want to check it out, you can find it linked in the description. 